Hey guys, Ryan here from the Ants America Ant channel. So today, I got my work gloves on, my test tube, shovels, got some bins over there. We are ready to go because today we are going to be queen hunting, queen catching. We're finding some queens, some colonies today. Um, so I'm here in my park. As you can see, there's a lot of open land, some grass. There's a, if I can pick this up really quick, I can show you guys a few things. So if you look down here, we got a lot of dirt and this goes all the way out. Just some, just a lot of grass so we can look around. There's also nice pads. Uh, after queens have their nuptial flight, um, they like to land and I like walking across the path and I usually, I found a few queens. There's actually a queen we have inside right now that I found on this path. But um, no, this is like awesome. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try to um, find some queens today, maybe some colonies, we'll see what happens, I don't know. But um, I'm not really sure what we're gonna get today. Hopefully we get something good. Um, but yeah, we'll see what happens. Um, we're gonna go ahead and look around. I'll show you what we can look for in the ground, where you should where you should dig and stuff. Cause we're doing some digging and like I said, nuptial flight queens, we can find them on the path. But it's not like a sunny day out. It's not a perfect day. So I don't think we're gonna get any nuptial flights. Um, so no freshly landed queens, but we'll definitely be able to dig today. So let's go do that. A few moments later. Alrighty guys, so me and Zach were walking uh, from the path, playground where we're sitting at all the way over there. But we were walking on the path and you can see here, is a pretty nice colony um to me they look like tetramorium pavement ants not positive but um this would be nice but it's on this uh asphalt pavement here so we can't actually dig them uh you can see they're digging out their nest entrance right there those are some really nice ants i really love tetramorium um those are the same species the pavement ants that have their wars uh, the ant war video uh so yeah just wanted to show you guys and over here we might be able to find this is where we found some of our um colonies last time we did some digging over here already you can see we pat patted down some dirt here after we dug i'm um, trying to show you guys a good place to dig um looking for a little colony colony hill that we can find uh here we go here's a pretty good spot so you just got to be walking on dirt and you'll find something. It's really hard to see. I don't want to disturb them. We, we're gonna have to dig it up anyways, just to give a check. But you can see there's a dirt there and there's a little hole entrance. There's also a bigger dirt mound here. So if I hand this over to Zach, we'll go ahead and take the shovel, stick it in, you pop it up right next to the hole. And we can see that there are, we got nothing here. There's some ants in here. These look like laceus, I'm not positive. Lots of ants here, so this is a really great way to um, have a chance at getting a colony. I'm, I'm pretty sure they're connected to here, um, so we can go ahead and pop this up really quick and maybe do something in the middle right here and pop the middle up. Yeah, we got some eggs right here, guys. Got some eggs here, some larva and even some pupae. I'm not sure Laceus have pupae, so maybe this isn't a Laceus colony, I'm not positive. Um, gonna keep doing some digging here. But as you can see, this is basically what we're gonna be doing. Um, it's hard to do it with Zach filming, so we're gonna go ahead and dig around here and dig a few other spots, and we'll come back to you guys and show you what we get. 20 minutes later. All right guys, so we've been digging for a little bit. And uh, in this snap vial cap that we have, Zach can show you real quick. I'm gonna keep digging. We got a Laceus queen uh, that just had her nuptial flight, I'm pretty sure. So she go ahead and she made her uh, little starter nest, and we ended up actually finding her, which is actually really cool. So she'll make a really good queen. I love Laceus. Oh, it's a spider. We got a worm that I accidentally just cut in half. <laughs> It's okay, worms can live cut in half. So. Are you finding anything? Uh, yeah, so one other thing, and that's why I'm still digging, you guys are probably really confused. There's a Fidoli colony that we have in this bucket so far, but no queen. I don't see queen, but there's a lot of eggs. Uh, so I'm trying to find, find where this queen is. <clears throat> Um, 
but I'm really excited, guys. Like, I've been trying so uh, hard the last few days to get a queen, and we uh, finally caught one. But a Fidoli colony? Now that would be amazing. If you've been here for a little while, you know Fidoli is my dream species of everything. I love, love Fidolis. The passion. I don't think you'd be able to see ants on here. These guys are so small. So there's a, let's see if we can get a little, there's some eggs in there, if you can see them. But I just wanted to update you guys and let you know about the uh, Lacey's Queen, but we're gonna go ahead and keep digging and I'll pull up the camera again if we find anything else on for those. Eventually. Alrighty, so the hole got bigger as you can see. So this bin right here, Fadoli colony. Uh, not sure if we got the queen yet. We're still searching. Maybe got the queen. We'll see. Right here, we do have a queen in here. I think she's at the lid. I'm not sure. No, she's at the lid. Tap her down. Oh, well, we still have this one here. That's getting really foggy. So we have two Lacey's queens. Maybe Lacey's, I'm not positive. I'm gonna have to ask you guys in the comments to make sure. So two right there, one there, one there. And then right in here, she's a second corner here. We found an entire colony um, with the queen. The queen is in here. Tons of eggs here, 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 here. We got tons of eggs. The queen was over here. Yeah, she's right, right there. there. And we got the queen right there. You can see in that little crevice. I'm not trying to make them mad. Bend it like this. No, 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 don't, don't, don't. Here it is. So the queen is in there, and then, um, I'm still looking, there's a few more workers that came with that colony that I'm trying to scoop up for them. <clears throat> I got some, like, eggs and stuff here. Drop those in. I'm just trying to get every part, every member of the colony, because they will die without her not being with the queen. But very successful day. Uh, as you can see, the title of the video is Catching Queen Ants in Colonies. So this is the method I use and it uh, definitely works. Um, but yeah. These are different colonies. So the best part is we started digging out one colony and then it led us to the Fidoli and then now it led us to three queens. Oh wow. Oh wow. Come on. And let's go there. Might wanna get the queens in there. It's unscrewed a little bit. There's a lot more eggs. Yep. I'm trying to gently scoop those in. So this is a very nice colony here. Pretty well established. Do you think it's Laceus? I, I'm not sure. Um, my gut feeling is to go Laceus because that's what they look like to me. But I will have to do some research. Hold on. Is this egg here? No, that's something else. Found a super big beetle in here. I can try and show you guys right here. Oh, Forgot what the name of that beetle is, but that is a they hurt a lot to get bit by. Um, I can tell you that from experience. Um, I have been bitten by one of those. But uh, besides that, guys, um, that was our update. It's hard to film because I need Zach digging with me to make sure we get everything from from these colonies when we find them so uh we'll update you guys again later but of course two queens third queen in there with a full colony these are gonna go in test tube setups hopefully they survive and fidoli we gotta find that queen i want a fidoli colony really bad so we'll catch up on you guys shortly uh see you then one hour later Alrighty, guys so 
we just uh, finished. We got four queens, maybe five, depending on the fiddle week. Gotta go check the box later tonight. Um, so we patted all that down, make sure we set everything back as best as possible. <coughs> Excuse me, I got the corona. Um, <coughs> uh, but we got this set in stone, we're good to go. Um, I think we're gonna be done for today. Uh, but I really just wanted to give you guys an educational tutorial and examples on how to catch queen ants, how queen ants work, and how to catch colonies. Um, so yeah, hope that helped you guys out. 12 o'clock midnight. Alrighty guys, we are back here in the house. As you can see, we have four test tube setups. Sorry for the shadow. I'm just trying to get some good lighting here. We got one, two, three, and then over here four. Um, all these test tube setups have our new... Um, Laceus Neglectus. I did some research in our break and figured out that they are, in fact, Laceus Neglectus. Um, all four of them are enjoying some cotton right now. As you can see, I did uh, provide them all with honey. None of them touched it. Uh, of course, you're not supposed to feed your queens, but I did find them. I didn't know if they were from an established colony or not. They looked like they were all in their claustral chamber. Um, so... Looks like they just landed from nuptial flight and dug a little hole. Um, not positive if that's what happened, but we shall see. I did want to explain why we were not recording while we were digging up the uh, ants. We were extremely, extremely uh, busy digging up and we freaked out when we found the ants and had to uh, make sure we got them. So I needed Zach shoveling with me i needed him grabbing test tubes grabbing snap cap vials i needed him to help me out and he couldn't hold the camera and do that at the same time real quick i'm going to do it individually i'm going to move this queen out of this shot a little bit all right we're going to individually show you guys the uh queens here so as you can see i'm not trying to get too close so it'll focus but we have a laceus neglectus queen all four of them are laceus neglectus um, our editor can also zoom in to give you a better picture right here. I don't want to get too close to the camera so it's still nice and clear. But, um, yeah, these queens are actually beautiful. Um, they look really nice. The workers also look awesome. I didn't see any workers with any of these queens. One of these queens did have a batch of eggs, but we lost them upon capture. So, they do lay a lot of eggs, um, and they don't lay in batches, so... Should be consistent egg laying coming out sometime soon. I'm gonna have to give him some peace and quiet though. And uh, hopefully that happens. So there's the first one, we'll set her over here. And here's the second queen, the Laceus Neglectus number two. Quick rotate, zoom in, not trying to bug her too much. Then we'll set her down. Um, this uh, specific queen does have some minor damages on the gaster and on her uh, midsection. Uh, pull another one in here. So I only had two real test tubes, hence why we have two plastic ones over there out of the shot. Um, I did order new test tubes, so hopefully those will come in soon. We have our third Laceus Neglectus Queen that we cut. Very, very cool. Um, nice and clear in this glass test tube rather than the plastic shots. Um, hold up a little bit so you guys can look a little bit more, but this queen looks beautiful like the other ones. Just wanted to show you that we got all four of them. Go ahead and put you out of the shot. And the last Laceus Neglectus Queen. Give her a nice view. But here we are. We got our, um, all of our queens. We gave you a little information on them. And we will be doing updates on them for you guys in the next week or so. I just want to, you know, make sure they're doing all right. Uh, but yeah, that's all four of our queens. We got two of them. Uh, test tube, it was really hard to not get dirt. She had a lot in her snap cap vial. Um, but yeah, she's looking great. She's cleaning herself right now. And all of them are enjoying the soothing humidity and the water from the uh, cotton ball test tube setup so they're all sitting there enjoying themselves hopefully we get some eggs uh, the next few days i'll check in on them in a couple days i do want to let them be alone and you know be ants you can't really bother the queens too much they'll get too stressed out they won't lay any eggs and they will die um just wanted to let you guys know that but here we are 
we got our um, all of our queens. We'll give you a little information on them. And we will be doing updates on them for you guys in the next week or so. I just want to, you know, make sure they're doing all right. But thank you guys for watching this Ants America video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please, please comment. Give a like. Those really help. The comments, I like talking to you guys. Likes really help push my videos. Give a good um, like percentage. And of course, subscribe. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subs. We're going to do a special video at 500 subscribers showing you all the ants I currently have. If that comes soon, you might be able to see some ants that you haven't seen yet in the video. So every single ant I own will be shown at 500 subscribers. So let's get to 500 subs. Tell your friends, family, anyone you know, go ahead sub to Ants America. And the last thing, in the description we do have a Discord server. Feel free to join. We're going to be hosting polls. I'll be talking to you guys a lot. You're going to have an easy way to communicate with me about your ants. I can talk to you about my ants, give you some tips. If you have any questions, I'm always there to answer your questions about ants. It's also a really nice way for you to talk to other ant keepers online and share your colonies with everybody. So it's just a nice area for us to group up and have some fun. So if you're open to that, please, please make sure you join the Discord. Once again, link is in the description. We're trying to grow the Discord server, so invite your friends and come on in. So once again, guys, thank you for watching this video. Hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. And some more comes out. Peace.